This week, I thought it would be interesting to compare the 6 Arc running one of the heaviest 243 bullets, the new 90 grain Hammer HHT, versus the 243 Win running one of the lightest Hammer bullets, the 69 grain Absolute Hammer. With one question in mind, which bullet is better, lighter, or heavier being pushed to max velocity? And we'll start with the 6 Arc. I'm going to use the middle charge of 29.4 grains of CFE 223, giving me 2,800 feet per second. Very typical for hammer bullets to stack up like this when using multiple charge weights. Not bad considering I was using a thermal. Now to test the 243 win in the 69 grain absolute hammer bullets. And here I'll be using the first charge of 45.5 grains of BLC2, giving me a velocity of 4655 feet per second. Even with these extremely dangerous hot loads, the bullets stacked in at 100 yards. And here are the bullets by the numbers. The HHT line of bullets has a minimal expansion of 1700 feet per second, which puts the 90 grain HHT out of the 6 arc at 550 yards. The absolute hammer bullet has a minimal expansion of 1800 feet per second, which puts the 69 grain absolute hammer at a 243 win at 570 yards. I'd say that's pretty equivalent. I'm not a big believer in foot pounds of energy theory, but to no surprise, the 90 grain HHT had about 100 foot pounds of more energy dump than the 69 grain absolute hammer at their respective max range. The 90 grain HHT has a higher BC than 69 grain absolute hammers due to its design and weight, which will definitely help buck the wind at distance. Using a 200 yard zero with a 5 inch radius, the 69 grain absolute hammer had a max point blank range of 310 yards, and with the same 200 yard zero and 5 inch radius, the 90 grain HHT had a max point blank range of 275 yards. 35 yards, I'd say that's pretty equivalent. My thermal 9 hunting shots are typically under 125 yards. At that range, the 90 grain absolute hammer will have a point of impact velocity of almost 3,200 feet per second and the 90 grain HHT will have a point of impact velocity of 2,525 feet per second. 400 yards is the absolute max distance I feel comfortable shooting off a tripod at night. At that distance, the 69 grain absolute hammer has a point of impact velocity of 2,200 feet per second and the 90 grain HHT has a point of impact velocity at 1,900 feet per second. That 310 feet per second is the distance of a football field in length, equaling significantly less holdover. So to answer the question from above, push to max velocity, lighter is better for my hunting purposes. Faster point of impact velocity, less holdover, and if you believe the numbers, more foot pounds of energy. Stay tuned for my next adventure and boy do I have a fun hunting video coming up.